button. Oh, he's sucking on my leg. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Before I was doing stuff like that, I was doing stuff like this. My name's Joey Antonelli and you're watching my channel. I've grown up in the same area my whole life, fishing the same waters with a family full of fishermen. Now I'm on the water more than ever. Thanks for tuning in to another episode and if you like what you see, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Now, let's get back at the action. <laughs> Antonelli in the great outdoors. We made it. Got to fly in on a private plane. There's the rig behind us. You've seen it before. It's Scott and Connie's 36 Jupiter. And we have, we have a big party first off. And we have an even bigger house. An absolutely gorgeous house. We're walking up. Oh my God, I'm getting lost. But that's about more of that later. I'll show you where we're going now. Go up through here. I don't really know where everything is. We'll, be, we'll explore over there later. Here's our host, Bruce. Boom. We have a giant house. We're gonna go through it all a little bit later. Honey, what's going on here? Hoggies. And it stopped. Nope, it's still on. That's all we're doing right there, just drifting chunks out. All sorts of different bait. We got squid, pogies, shrimp, silver size. That was a ballyhoo chunk. I'm just letting them back. out of that one piece, yeah. Come on, be the right one. I think it is. On the little rod. Feel the really fast tail shakes. Let's go. We got a mutton on me. Pound breed. Can I go around? Yeah, yeah. You guys move that pole? I got one too. Do you? It's little. Mine feels like a little. Oh, there it is. All she has is a little yellow tail. She's fighting so weird though. Yeah, that's a snapper. Yeah, it's bouncing. I think he's in a rock. Just keep steady pressure on him and then usually they'll come out.
Uh oh. That was that mutton for sure. How deep is it? 22. You go down and get it? Yeah, we can definitely slide it over there and get them. I mean, keep tension on it. Yeah. Oh, maybe, maybe. I don't know what's happening. I mean, <laughs> he's gone. Holy crap. You got There are some nice buttons down there. Really? This <laughs> fucking kid. Save your value. <laughs> I am. Oh, it's a group. It's a group one? Yeah, that's a mark. Oh, it's a mark. I'm gonna just sling him right up into the boat. Alright, Connie, I would have done that for you too. Watch your feet, Connie. Yep, here you go. Oh, a nice fish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I saw a nice, gr a nice little black, too. Really? Yeah. You just wanna go shoot or you wanna fish? No, no, fish them. You know, those things will disappear if you start shooting them. What happened, Joey? The black was. He was hanging, uh, tangled up in a branch. There's a bunch of branches oh, really? down. Yeah, like tree branches. Think it would have come loose or? I don't know. He was pinned. He might have swam out. But there was a black grouper in there with him, like checking him out, like all curious of the commotion. And I swam over and I saw the black grouper somewhere. I was like, oh, he came off. But then I saw him pinned in there. Nice. The black grouper swam off all slow. And I was like, that was weird. Like he wasn't even all frantic. Hold him up, Connor. All right. Nice fish. Let's That's go. Awesome. Yeah, that was the easiest mutton I've ever shot. Did he move or look at you? No, he was, he was exhausted pinned against the branches. Here, why don't you get over here? Nice mutton. Little rod. Good fish. Yours was decent, Scott. It looked good. Yeah. You had a bigger rod. Yeah. I'm glad we didn't get deep enough. Oh, he's going out. All right. We gotta get it farther. Farther back. Big chunks. Big chunks. Coming right across that stuff where Connie's fish got before. That's right. I know Connie will repay the favor <laughs> and go down there and help me out. The funniest thing ever. I thought it was a cuda following him, and I thought it was a group. Yeah, I saw the frickin' you know, seaweed having I will. Yes! Bruce is a bad net man. man. That's a nice yeah. one. Really yeah. nice. There's the weed. Look at he camouflaged on the weed. Golly, he turned the color like the weed. Yeah. Crazy. That is nuts. That is a great get. Here's that. Another mutton. Look at that thing. Connie just hooked one too during the chaos. Oh, he's going under us. That's all right, that's all right. Should I go around? Yeah, watch out. Watch the motors, oh, stick the rod Mason. all the way down. Oh, Mason. I'll get out of the rod. <laughs> <laughs> it's craziness going on over here. What do you think, are you in bo- Oh, you got a shark. Wow. Dang it. It's a baby tiger shark. All right, Bruce, it is the coolest catch of the trip now. All right, we might have to get a bit closer. That is a baby tiger. Look how cool that is. There you go, that's all we wanted. There we go.
look at that view. That is just gorgeous. Stopping home, mutton fishing, went great. A little bit of diving. Uh, before we go ahead and clean up the fish and cook that up, we're gonna go ahead, chill out in the AC for a little, and then we got a couple little stops we're gonna make. This isn't sketchy. How many people can go on this at once? Let's try, 30. come on, for the video. Let me get over there and then I'll film. Okay. I'll film how many people well, you can fit on there. Are we going together? Yeah. <laughs> Brother and sisters break through boards. That's equal to a big person going on it. Are you calling Piper big. fat? No, I'm saying together you're <laughs> fat. All right. These rocks feel awesome. Really not that bad. I'm supposed to jump off this. I don't like jumping off stuff. I like don't jump off stuff. Do I just aim at Piper? Where is it? Oh, that one sinks. Where is it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> fish are these? Did it hit Allison? Alright, now we got it thumbed up. More piggies, more piggies. It's like Mason got to this one. Look at him, they're just chilling down there. They're so good at smelling, like, they know that's not food. Oh. <laughs> Piper, what are you doing to it? I'm just holding it. Oh, he's a happy little guy. Oh, yeah, he's happy. We made a little stop by the Stingray Island. I cannot figure out why they call it the Stingray Island. That's a big one. These stingrays do have barbs. Most of them do. Oh, he got some food. How shallow have you gotten them? What food have we got enough? <laughs> I can pull out a pack of hot dogs and even eat them. That is so cool. Let it eat. See if it'll take it out of your hand. I'll do it. Give me one. Where's the stick? Yeah, they'd be busting down some filet. Huh? Oh my god, he's eating my foot. Really? Don't let that barb touch you. Is it okay if the tail hits you? Yeah, just don't let them stab you. Okay, bro, I think as long as you stay still, you're fine. Wait, let's take yeah. Don't freak out. They don't want to reach your coming behind you. There she's watching. Oh, you're cool, buddy. Okay. These things are huge. Can we give us some steaks? Whoa. Well, Mom, what do you want me to do? Bye, Scott. Throw it in, throw it in. No, the birds are going to get it. Piper saved you. Uh oh. Okay, close. Oh, that one's really cute. This is too big. 
This is all fat. Get away, right, birds. Don't let the bird get it. I want this big one. Come here, big boy. Oh my Dang, word. Doesn't it doesn't feel cool when they touch you? Bro, it felt so weird. He was on, he just touched me. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, he's sucking on my leg. <laughs> no. I think you just need to stay still, though. Like, don't like freak out and run. Yes, they're back. Okay. <laughs> that's the that's the bar the barbs up by the base of the tail. No, it's like it's like up towards a little bit further forward. Oh yeah, we got some sharks too. Oh, no, those sharks can definitely turn around and bite their tail. That is so cool. Big barb. Right there. <laughs> and a little guy. Stubby tail. Put it down a little bit Behind you, Lauren. <laughs> Behind you? Can you walk backwards? Alison, you want to go get down there and picture with everyone? <laughs> Hold it out far, Piper, and then bring them in with it. <laughs> yeah. You got it right there. <laughs> Ooh, I had that barb right next to my heel. Or ankle. Oh my god. That one's going for a ride. He growled. I can't believe you do that. Yes. Get a picture of Joey with all the That's what I'm doing right now. Oh, there's a death spiral. A death spiral. Oh, they took off. Where did the nurse shark go? Oh, yeah. Backward shuffle. That was a big chunk. That's big chungus. Now that is a good looking cooler. Let's get these muttons up here. Look at all them muttons. Look at the colors on these things. Watermelon tails. What do we got going on in here? Ceviche. What's in here? Peppers, onions, citrus, salt and pepper. Citrus is a pretty broad category. Orange, lemons. Ooh, we got, I also got a couple mangoes. Ooh. Are they hard enough soft enough? We might be able to add a mango to that, but this is ceviche. We've done it on the channel before. It's cooked, so it's not raw fish, but it's cooked with no heat. It's cooked in the acids of the citrus we're putting in there. And we're gonna let that sit. Connie's. Dicing up some of that mutton that we just cut up. Add some going there, and then we'll probably add some mango too for a little sweetness. That was some of the action today, some of the other fun stuff that's not really fishing related. But now we're back home, it's nighttime, and we have a true Bahamian in the house cooking tonight. We got our mutton here with some blackening, but there's some other surprises. What do we got? We got blackened mutton. We got real Bahamian mac and cheese that we got from the local place. We're heating it up. 
And then we have peas and rice. Peas and rice is like a staple of the Bahamas. It's the same with the mac and cheese. It's kind of like getting fries with a sandwich over back home. But that's what we're doing and we're gonna get to it. Oh yeah. That's it, we got it. We got mac and cheese salad, mutton snapper, rice. And here's the appetizer right here. Already had some of that, that's the conch salad. It's all super good. Scott, what do you gotta say? Scott, we need a speech. Mutton is so Connie already said that, you need your own original speech. Come on. Thank you for having us. Hope Town 2021. Okay, there we go. We'll take it. We'll take it. Name something Woody like Bruce, like Mutt Ba Business. This is just day one. We just got here yesterday. Got some good food now. I'm gonna finish it up. And then, I don't know what we're doing tomorrow, but we'll do something else. Later.